to gather again to entertain and play games. Welcome back, we're the 2-Bit Players. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. I'm your host, Noah. I'm Hiccup Free, and we're the 2-Bit Players. We'll see. I'm Jeffrey. And uh, we are fighting this dude. This armed monstrosity. This uh, monster. Uh, yeah, and I'm, I can focus now because he's not going to get the better of me. Because he's, uh, because I don't have the hiccups anymore. Because you don't have the hiccups anymore. Yeah. Now you're unstoppable. That was the downfall. You're of... reaching your full potential. Hit him in the Come face. Come on. Come on. Okay. I definitely have to get him from behind. Are you sure? I absolutely do. Because then the, the reticule turns yellow, oh. which means damageable. Let him do it. Out of the way. Out of the way. Okay. Come on. Do the overhead. Do the overhead, you brute. You brute? You brute skate. Remember that game Brute Force? It was one of the first games on Xbox. What? Oh, come on! Ow! You didn't even throw it at anything. I did. I hit him, but it was like his shoulder was was not exposed in the proper way. Come here. Come here, you... you, you yeah, what, what, what about Brute Force? I just remember that game. Brute Force. It was like one of the first games on the 360. Okay. And it looked like a real shit ah. Xbox game. Okay, I got him. I don't know, I never played it. It sounds vaguely familiar. I don't know why I'm even talking about it. Remember <laughs> Fighting Force? That sounds... On the PlayStation Uns? Remember Shining Force? Remember uh, Delta Genesis? Force? Remember Delta Farce? Oh my god! Um, Wait, I gotta tell you this. Know what blew my mind the other day? No. Come on, come on. If I did, you wouldn't, you wouldn't be talking about this. Uh, Molly and I were watching Dirty John, which is a great Netflix series you should totally watch. Yeah, I'll get, oh uh, yeah, I'll, next thing oh, it's I'll a watch. a true story. Yeah. But anyways, uh, the music was created by God No! By Sorry. God No? <laughs> yeah. Uh, by Mark Mothersbaugh, or Mothersbaugh, I don't know how you say that. Sure. Do you, does the name ring a bell at all to you? Nope. It rang a huge bell to me. And so I looked him up, and I was like, oh, yeah, I recognize his name from the opening credits of the Rugrats. He okay. was the creator of the music and the whole soundtrack for all the Rugrats movies no and TV way. series. And he's the lead singer and co-founder of Devo. What? <laughs> yeah. So the guy that made the, the Rugrats Devo theme. Devo wrote the Rugrats wrote, theme song? Whip it good. <laughs> what? Do you think he, they played the Rugrats theme at concerts? Maybe. I'd be fucking nice. Come on, right in the asshole. Yeah, don't put a rock in his asshole, bro. <laughs> That'll teach him. That'll teach him real good. Teach him a sour lesson he won't soon forget. Sooner or later. Oh, no! Whoa, get out of there! I'm trying, I'm trying, I'm trying. Get out of It's a game of strip rock throwing. There we go. Are there any more rock... Barrels to go with. Oh shit! Don't you have uh, more rocks? I think I got like two or so. Oh, he is in range. Yeah, he's 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 in. Oh, I think I got one. Ah! Out of the way. You're really pushing it. Hey, pal. the rocks came back. <laughs> hey, nice. Out of the way. Uh, more rocks. Okay, 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 okay. Rocks are the least of your issues. This guy's aggressive. Enough. There you go. Take a second, take a second, get him in the, no, in the face. Try to get him in the crotch. Why? Hit him in the head. Because, dude, You just unlocked the neck thing, so now you can knock his helmet off. Oh, maybe? Definitely not now. Oh, God. <laughs> did we say we're the tuba players? Doesn't matter. Yes, no. we did in our intro. Oh, that's we true. We intro ourselves in every animated intro. I worked hard on that. Here we go. We're the two-bit players. We're the two-bit players. I'm Jeffrey. You're Noah, and we're the two-bit players. Beautiful. Come on. Do the side swipes, because I'm not in front of you anymore, you brutski. Let's go. Brutski. Brutski. I saw the movie Pain and Glory. Okay. Starring Antonio Banderas. Okay. He's nominated for Best Actor. Uh, and the movie is also nominated for Best Foreign Film. It's a Spain. Okay. Spain. Is it Beautiful. called Spain, Spain and Glory? Should be. Okay. Should be, but it's not. Tisn't. Pain and glory. Um, oh, back thing. There it, it is. It was interesting. There you go. 
Oh, no, no, not now. Right in the face. Oh, Took him down, idiot. dude. Of course. Why, did Why not? Because he's dead and I won and I'm you, better than him. God, you fool. The villagers are like, you're our leader now. She should just literally, while they're standing there at that gate, just start popping them off. Maybe. Pop, pop, pop. You, you could. Lead singer of Devo wrote the theme to Rugrats? Yeah, right? Isn't that crazy? Bananas, dude. Yeah. He's also like an accomplished visual artist, too, and has all these uh, exhibits across the world in museums. What? Yeah, man. That's wild, He's bro. He's my new hero. Um. Come on, Amicia. You can do they this. They really took a moment there, huh? Well, I mean, they needed to figure out what the strangers were worth running away from. Oh, oh chapter she was... three! Oh, out of what? Three? I don't know. 200? <laughs> 200 chapters. What does 200 even look like in Roman numerals? Is it a C? Because century, and that's like a hundred. Mm, no, century is a hundred. And you think of like a centurion. M as... is a thousand. L is 50. Is M a thousand? How do you know these things? C is a hundred? That would be so my be guess. two Cs? Yeah, two Cs. But if the C is left of the other C, it's C minus C, so it's actually before zero. Hundred. So it's actually zero. Oh, okay. Like X X X mm -hmm. is actually zero. Triple X. Oh God. Explore the chats. No, wouldn't X X X be ten? Because it's ten before ten, and then another ten. Whoa. Ten before ten, and then after ten. What if the what if the third ten is the what ten, and there's two tens before that? So it's negative 10? So it's actually negative 10. <laughs> XXX is negative 10. Now how do you do 30? 30 would be XXX. No, wouldn't it be XXL? No, that's extra, extra large. Oh, fuck, you're right. Ooh, what's this? Double XL? Like, would it be XXX? Aw, Hugo. He's accepted his parents' death. Oh, so it goes to 40 XL. That would be XL, I think, yeah. So it's so thirty nine is X X X V I I I I. No, that would be. It would be no. It would be uh, X X X I X. Am I right? Are you looking it up? Yeah, no. Because nine is is I X. Nine is I X. Yeah, so thirty nine would be X X X I X. X I X? X X X for 30 and then I X for the 9. Uh, yeah, no, that would make sense. Yeah. Praying. Can I use it to talk to you? I got a rosary. Oh, I got to pray now, maybe? Oh, okay. Got to, time to pray. Always make time. Let's go. Down in the river to pray. Staying about that good old way. And who shall wear robe and crown? Good Lord, show me the way. I don't know the lyrics. As I went down in the river to pray. Studying about that good old way. Okay. okay. Uh, <laughs> they prayed. And I literally wasn't watching. I know that apologies, song. Apologies, apologies. I know that all song around. from uh, Bioshock Infinite. I know that song from the old No Country. No, uh, Oh Brother, Where Art Thou soundtrack. <laughs> oh Brother, Were Old Men. I was like, Old Country for No Men. Old Country for Old No Men. Oh Brother, Where Art Thou? Old Country for an, an Old Men? <laughs> no, old no Country men. for No Men. Old Country for No Men. Okay, can't do anything there. The movie's called No Country for Old Men, right? It is. Why the fuck is it called that? Or is it? Um, been, I haven't seen it since I saw it in theaters. I don't know. That's a good movie. Help me find an escape route, Jeffrey. You want to talk to her. What? The statue. Why? That's Hello, a man. statue. I'm wondering how to escape a lot from this church. What door did you come in? This is really sacrilegious, but I thought that guy was like blowing the dude on the right, and the woman walked in. She's like, "Oh my god!" No, he's blowing the dude on the left, and the dude on the right is banging the dude in the middle. Oh, that could be true too. It's a good time, depending on how you look on it, and that is why religions are so hard to agree upon. <laughs> it's uh, all matter of perspective. Two two religious men walked in here. One saw one thing, the other saw the other thing, <laughs> and such the schism was born. And such. Um, Okay, so there's nothing left to do over there. Over here. Hey, 
Oh, ladder. <laughs> ladder out of this broken ass window. I don't know, last time Hugo went up a ladder, it crumbled immediately underneath him. Oh, yes. So you had to follow him, like, right behind? Yeah. Children! What are you doing here? Children! Mother, we need help! Leave! It's dangerous! You have no business being here! Answer me this question! Please. What did you see when you looked at the stained glass portrait? <laughs> Was it an interrupted fellatio? <laughs> or a three-person orgy? <laughs> um... Uh, uh, Be careful, uh, your answer is very important. It was the interrupted fellatio. Blasphemer! Kill her! <laughs> Kill her! She is one of them! There is only the orgy! <laughs> Everybody knows. Oh, Ooh, you man. got a fabric. I got a fabric. So there's like a craftable upgrade tree for my slang. Oh, you got a soul fair. Which I guess I make a fire slang with. Oh, uh, um, nothing there. Oh, but there's something grabbable up here. Nope, just pots and potions. Just a bunch of fucking cock teasers. Cool. Cock teasers. No, Jeffrey, the cock teasers was the other stained glass oh, portrait. Oh, but they've got... It was the one that was broken. Yeah, <laughs> that's the DLC. That one was very graphic. <laughs> I know that that's one was... Not... There was no misinterpreting that. The monks must have put them in the water to purify themselves. Mother used to do the same. Hmm. So should we do it? So probably not. It's probably filled with plague now. Mother used to do the same until she was stabbed through the ass with a giant sword. Giant sword through the gate. Through the gate, out the ass. By Sir Nicholas. Okay, nothing there. Hmm. That's a dead end. Okay. Hmm. Did you see something like glisten over here? Or is yeah, that just yeah, like... dude, and I'm not going to tell you. Oh, it's a it's I got a saltpeter. Saltpeter, not sulfur. Or, salt or saltpeter. Get that axe. Fuck shit up. Get the axe. I will in a Fuck second. Fuck shit up. No. <sighs> Why don't you ever listen to me? Because I need to pick carnations with you. <sighs> You're pissing off my dog, Jeffrey. Uh, this is what he growls at you because you just make animal noises. Uh, oh, God. Stop it. Stop it. I'm clearing my throat, Nigel. It itches. Maybe he's clearing his throat. Maybe we're clearing our throats together. Okay, Jeffrey's stopped antagonizing my dog. Dude, he was trying to alpha me, bro. I wasn't going to let it happen. Just submit to the beta, Jeffrey. Just sub <laughs> submit to the beta? Beta life ain't that bad. Come on. <laughs> Who's the alpha between the three of you? You, between Molly, Molly, you and, Molly and, and Nigel. Nigel. You think so? No. I get in his face. I mean, face. I think you guys kind of have to be the alpha because you feed him. He's got to respect us. He has to. Yeah, I think you probably... Who's, who's the Nigel? Who, who feeds him? Both of us. Oh. We both do it together all the time. Who punches him? Nobody. Oh. You do, apparently. I do. When no one's looking, I punch him real good. You come over while we're sleeping <laughs> and punch my dog. <laughs> I got you. sulfur and another <clears throat> cord. I'm getting all this sort of collectibles. What are, what are your thoughts about potentially growing a mustache? I won't. I just never see what do that. Happens. I think they're disgusting. Just see what happens. You should grow a mustache and it's nicer than mine. Like I, it's fucking glorious. I, for a fact, no, that would not be the case. No, look, look wait, look at me. You could easily grow a mustache. My facial hair is not that good, no, man. No, you could. No, the mu my facial hair is terrible. Mm. But my mustache is tits, dude. Speaking of terrible facial hair, here's Father Thomas. No idea. Leave while you still Please. can. Someone has to help us. Do it for him at least. What the fuck is this game about? Plague tales and innocence. Yeah, but like, so everyone's trying to kill anybody who has the plague, but now they're just killing anybody who just walks up. Well, because they think they're infected. I don't know. They made they got plague-addled brains. Uh, is it like the like the Las Plagas? Maybe. But also, they were showing off like demonic shit in the beginning, and I haven't seen any of that. It's probably going to be mounting soon. Good sign. The Inquisition. Oh. They came and they. So the Inquisitions were being invaded by the Spanish. What is happening the Spaniards? The Spaniards. The Spain and Glories. Or... Spain and Glory. Or you will die. Father, the villagers wanted to kill us. Oh, they 
Your choices are stay and die, or leave and die. And die later. Oh, I, I, I cannot leave the church, uh, but an exit um, through the crypt of the three saints. It may not be too late. Uh, I shall try to put you on the path to Laurentius' farm, but uh, after that, uh, may God watch over you. If there is a God. <laughs> If he is not already dead. If the god did not catch the plague. <laughs> did you see Joker? I didn't, no. Oh. Yeah, this music too. reminds me of the score to that. You were saying that before, yeah. Wow, huh. should we explore these cavernous caves? Never? No, next time. Okay. Thanks for the view, now comment, like, and subscribe, because we're all just two-bit players.